Hi everyone, welcome back. In today's tutorial, I'm gonna walk you through two features about the learning site on the topic of assignments and how you can assign items to your students across different courses, as well as how you can also set delays on assignments for if you don't want your students to see things right away. Let's jump in. In order to do that, you would come to your dashboard and select your course. I'm gonna pick uh, my period one for EC1 Spanish. And then I'll go straight to the assignments tab. You can see I already have a couple of assignments there. I want to add something here. So I'm going to go to unit three. Comunica, let's do the video blog. Double click and it's there. Hit next. And then here's where I can pick which courses I want this activity to go to. Uh, I might be selective and only give to a few students that maybe um, I'm differentiating the lesson for. I might want to give this to all of my classes. So for now, I just want this to go to uh, my first period class, hit next. And then here's where I can either say that all my courses are gonna have the same due date, I can pick the date and time, or I can say no due date. For this one, I'm being flexible. There's no due date for this one. So I'm just gonna assign it now to my students. And here it will show up in my assignments tab. Another way that you can assign to students is through the content tab. So you're searching through the content side, looking through and while you're doing lesson planning and you think, oh, I forgot to include a video or an activity here. You can do that very quickly. Let's go to unit four. Here I'll pick, maybe I want them to do the end Camino. And where it says the flag of assign, this is how you'll know that you can immediately quickly assign things to students. So I want them to do a, uh, uh, this activity with the blog. Again, I will then pick which classes I want it to go to. This time I'm gonna set a delay because the minute I assign something to students, it's gonna automatically go to them quickly. I don't want them to see this right away. So they're all gonna have the same due date, but I'm gonna pick the due date as being the 26th, but then I wanna assign it with a delay. So again, they're all gonna have the same delay, but I'm gonna wait and I want it to show up on the student's assignment side as a notification on the 22nd. And there you go, I've created the assignment and it will show up as a delay. I'll let you know where that goes. So I come back to my assignment side and I will be able to tell which assignments are assigned immediately and which ones have a little bit of a delay next to them that are indicated. Hope you've enjoyed the learning site updates. Hope you thought they were useful and that you will try out these features soon. Stay tuned to the Wayside blog for future updates, or you can always check out what's happening on the learning site through our release notes by clicking down here below. Uh, stay tuned and feel free to let us know if you have any questions or suggestions. You can always email us at info at waysidepublishing.com. Thank you so much.